Our bodies are extraordinary. We throw all sorts at them and they hardly ever let us down. Inside us, the lungs, the heart, the kidneys are parts of an amazing machine, constantly working away to keep us alive every second of every day. None of us leads a perfect lifestyle, but with the right knowledge, there's a lot we can all do to look after our vital organs. As a doctor and an anatomist, it's my job to know what our organs look like and how they work. And I'm fascinated by the way the human body is put together. But I want to get out of the lab and see how our organs cope with the challenges of the real world. In this series, we're going to look at the organs of the body, what happens to them when they go wrong, and how we can all keep them working better for longer. And today, we're learning to love our kidneys. I want to see how the kidneys deal with dehydration. If you pee at all, can you make sure it goes in there? And meet people who determine to prevent damage to theirs. Sweaty. Very unattractive look, but yeah, energised. I'll test my own responses to a sugar rush and other things. And I'm hoping to see for myself the dramatic treatment available when kidneys fail. I'm still not sure that this, this transplant is doable yet. In the next half hour, we'll all learn how to look after our kidneys so they can look after us for a good, long lifetime. This is my user guide to your kidneys. The most amazing thing about our kidneys is the sheer volume of fluid that they process without us being aware of it. In just seven seconds, this huge dam fills out as much water as I will wee out in a lifetime. But if we're talking about how much volume the kidneys filter in a lifetime, then that's a lot more. Equivalent to nearly a quarter of an hour's worth of water flowing over this dam. If I live to be 80. Kidneys. Now these are actually pig's kidneys, but they're very similar to human kidneys and you'll notice immediately.